Back at the No BS Mortgage Scenario Board, let's take a look at our scenario today. Today we got a customer who makes about $110,000 for the year. They have debt right now of only an auto loan for $485 monthly. Their savings they have to work with is about $52,000. Their credit score is pretty good at $740, and we're looking at a single family house right here using an FHA loan. Let's dive into the numbers, see what it looks like. After looking at the numbers, this is what I came up with. They qualify for about $540,000 roughly. Their down payment's 3.5% with an FHA loan, so it's about $18,900. Total closing cost in this scenario is about $10,000. In this case right here, the seller was able to offer them about $3,000 credit towards their closing cost. So there that is right there. The lender, it's zero credit on this scenario because they went with an interest rate that doesn't have any credit or points. Cash to close, they're looking at about $28,900 out of their pocket. Here's a monthly breakdown with the taxes and insurance and the mortgage insurance. This also has the updated mortgage insurance now that FHA has a lower uh, mortgage insurance premium, which is great for the home buyer. Total payment, you're looking at about $41.30 all in, and then the rate we're looking at is 6.25. For this scenario right here, the advice I'd give this customer, if they want to increase their purchase price, I'd probably look at eliminating the 485 auto loan if it's doable because they have extra funds. Or might even look at a conventional loan, in this case, putting down 5%. Because they have a good credit score, they might, their mortgage insurance might be even cheaper. So those are two tips right there. If you have any questions or scenarios, shoot me a DM or leave a comment down below. Make sure to follow for more No BS Mortgage Tips.